Laura Hartman, the paintings conservator for the Dallas Museum of Art, and we're here in the paintings conservation studio to look at some of the work we did for devoted art and spirituality in Mexico and New Mexico. In preparation for this exhibition, we were able to take the opportunity to look at many of these works that have not been shown in quite some time, and we worked collaboratively with Mark Castro, the curator of the exhibition, to perform technical analysis using various techniques. All of these techniques gave us a better sense of each individual piece, the care they needed. For example, this complicated and extraordinary painting, which is from sometime in the 18th century, and also these small silver medallions, or milagros, which were attached later in the 19th century. And the examination gave us a really nice sense of both the painting and the addition of those little milagros. The person that did this was doing it both from a devotional point of view, but also a very decorative place. And you can see some of the milagros um, create texture and design, but some of them follow the actual image very closely. So this milagro is in the shape of a dove and it's sewn in directly on top of the painted dove. Because of the complexity of the work itself, this project was a collaboration with my colleague Elena Torok, who is the objects conservator here at the Dallas Museum of Art. And Elena is still um, working on securing all of the milagros that are loose and also replacing some that have fallen over the years. I would like visitors to know that this act of using art for devotion is, an, is a living art and it's still happening today. You can see it um, all over the world and throughout Mexico. I also think it's important for visitors to spend time looking at these works of art, pay attention to the details, really focus on the hand of the artist and why these objects were made to get a, a personal experience with each work of art.